One of the great skills of cricket is the art of spin bowling. We're very fortunate today to have with us Pat Simcox, the South African off spinner. And we're going to deal with off spin first. We'll come back to Pat in a minute. We're going to ask the youngsters here how they hold the ball for off spin bowling. Can we, sh can we all have a look, guys, just how you hold the ball for off spin bowling? Okay. Well, let's have a look at the, the way that these guys, all who are off spinners, got into that position in terms of grip. Okay. Let's have them all copy me. First of all, let's hold the ball, the seam down, parallel to our bodies. Okay. Let's have a look. Well done. Okay, let's take the first two fingers of our spinning hand and let's push them down onto the ball, creating a lot of purchase so the ball doesn't slip out. Can we all do that, guys? That's it. Now, let's fold the hand round the ball, okay, so that the thumb joins the first finger. And let's feel, okay, the pressure on the first finger, on here, on here, and on here, and so on. Okay, that's good, guys. Now, from there, we actually have to spin the ball, okay, like opening a door, okay, let's open a door, doorknob like that, and really spin. Now, as we do that, okay, the finger is going to create the spinning of the seam, okay, watch, see how my finger spins the ball out, okay, so that's it, you can all try that, okay, so that's really what we're trying to do. Right, let's see the grip again. Make sure the fingers go down onto the ball, onto the seam, so we create pressure on the first finger. Fold the hand over, okay, so the thumb runs up to join the first finger. Make sure that the pressure is on that finger because that's the one that's going to create the turn, as you can see from there. Okay, that's good. Let's just try that, guys. That's brilliant. Okay, right, Pat, that's the orthodox grip. You've got your own style, I'm sure, after 20 years of spinning the ball. Um, let's have a look at yours, and guys, let's just check him out. Right, Bob. I started the same way, by having the same technique. But obviously, as you say, through years, my fingers have expanded. And I now have a much wider grip on the ball. And in so, I don't come in at that angle down. I really just put my hand around the ball there. And I've got a...